Hello everyone, in this video tutorial we will be learning how to convert the coordinates from one coordinate system to another coordinate system. For this purpose, we have a coordinates in the Indian grid system Kalyanpur 1975. We have four points A, B and C. For these points, the easting and northing are available, are given. The unit for these uh, coordinate system are yards okay now open the global mapper in the global mapper go to the tools and the coordinate coordinate converter in this coordinate converter we have select input coordinate system and the output coordinate system we can choose in uh, the and set uh, and we can make the set of uh, input coordinate system as well as the output coordinate system in the input coordinate system we will be setting the this system for the available coordinates and the output will be for the desire uh, so that we need uh, for which we need the coordinates to be converted. So for this purpose, I will select input coordinate system. In input coordinate system, first of all, I will uh, use and will set the projection. In the projection tab, click on the drop down and select here. There are a lot of uh, projections available. You can choose anyone according to your coordinates that are available in that projection. So my coordinates are in the Indian grid, grid zone, zone grid. So I will select this one and my area is falling in the India 1 zone. So I will select this one. now to know about where your area of uh, interest is falling uh, in the indian zone 1 zone 2 or zone 2 b zone 3 a so for this i have uh, we, the we have available the zone map so you can see in this map that where your area of interest is falling so my area of interest like this, this the, these coordinates are from the Balochistan in this zone. So my zone is zone 1A and this is zone 0, zone 2 and this is zone 3A, zone 2B, this is zone 1B. So you can check it like this. This map is available on in, uh, Google. You can search search for this map. So, to set up uh, the datum, select the Indian 1975 and select the unit. I will use the yard because my coordinate system, my uh, coordinates are in the yard. The units that have been used are yards. So I will select the yard and now click, click OK. Now I will put my coordinate one by one, the easting and the northing here. Keep in mind that you can uh, convert these coordinates only one by one. To do all at once, we will we will do that in the ArcGIS Pro later on in the next video tutorial. Now, for point A, I will copy coordinates copy the easting and I will put here now remove this and control B this is the easting now the north thing
now click on the convert to now the conversion has been success successfully uh, the coordinates have been successfully converted now it says that the result copied to clickboard use control v to paste them into another application once i i i, I click okay the coordinates will be automatically copied okay now it's been cop uh, selected or copied now i will paste it in the google earth or you can also paste it in the um, in this excel sheet like this i will use points easting northing like this now click here and paste it so it will paste like this and our output coordinate system let me show you our output coordinate system is in the geographic latitude longitude and the unit is arc degrees you can also change the output coordinate system from here the desired output coordinate system so i've been used or selected this projection and coordinate system okay now do this exercise for all of the points or you can also directly can paste it in the google app like this so you can see that we can see the point so i will um, add a point here this is point a like this and click ok all right now do this exercise for all of the points available copy it paste it here this is actually the same but i will paste it here and convert to okay now you can paste it here as well and also in the google app you can directly paste it in the google app control v now paste your point and b The northing is same for this point, so I will leave it like this and convert. Okay. Now paste it here as well as you can paste it in the Google Earth. is d now to see all of your points like this so let me make a kmz for it the polygon and my point a is this one so zoom in zoom it max maximum and add this now go to the color fill out outline and select this color and make it the width make it 2 now 
place the point here another point zoom it so that to minimize the error So this is our lease KMZ. Now you can see that our coordinates have been plotted successfully. We can also convert this Excel sheet like this. Okay. Copy it now. Open another Excel sheet, paste it like this. Remove the north, and from here, the east. Now, save this is KMZ. Save it, uh, uh, save is. CSV file CSV comma delimited least CSV save it now let me uncheck these points Now load this KMZ uh, CSV file to the Google Earth and drop it. Comma delimited next points easting and northing. Now finish. Click yes, existing OK, points and OK. Save it. Uh, actually, we have uh, selected the wrong easting and uh, northing. So, I will once again change the easting and northing. Delete this uh, CSV from here. And now again, I will drag and drop here. Next. Now here. You have to select northing because the latitude is northing and the longitude is easting. And click yes, string. Okay, create okay. points. Okay, now click okay. Yes, now you can see zoom in and check it from here. So you can see the points are now in their proper position. You can see that. These are the points that we have just added here. Go the properties. You can select the uh, share the style color from here and select the this time up icon. And you can see now. So you can like this. You can uh, convert the different coordinate system from one coordinate system to another coordinate system one by one. And you can create an Excel sheet, and that that Excel, uh, the Excel and that Excel sheet can be converted to KMZ like this. And you can now save this as a KMZ file, uh, KMZ or KML. But this is a very tedious job. Uh, converting a lot of coordinates one by one is not easy. So in the next video tutorial, we will be covering how to convert all these coordinates that are available in this excel sheet we will convert that at once into different uh, coordinate system 
so that will be very easy and very time uh, efficient and we will save our time so for now um, this is enough and thank you for watching the videos